What's going on YouTube? Sam's I get you here with more Digimon pack openings. Um, I say we jump right into it because it is a new set. I'm really excited to see what's in here. Uh, if you did enjoy last week's, please feel free to stick around. If you missed last week's, it's where we open the first four packs from this box. And let's get into it with our... If we roll an even starting number on the die, we'll flip a coin at the end of the video to see if we open up the two card the pre-release pack for Battle of Omni. If it's an even start, um, we'll look at doing the promo for the entirety of the sets. Okay, so we're going to be flipping coin at the end. If we call the coin right, we will open up this promo pack that we've had since I think the first, maybe second opening on this, actually pretty early into the openings of, the, of these videos. Uh, give me a second to focus the camera, and we'll, uh, we'll get into this, yeah? Alright, let's get down to business. Um, Battle of Omni, pack number one. Oh, man. I swear, unless if I open the entire box in one sitting, it feels like I haven't done this in forever when I get back to it, you know? So, let's do that. Alright. How's that looking on here? Good? Perfect. Okay, so we have a Dorbitmon. Black Growlmon. Weedmon, Gaussmon, okay. Coelomon, probably Colomon, Nightmon, Ooh, pretty cool. A meteor shower yellow option. Okay. A blazing storm of metal. What's this? It's for the machine deck. Till the end of your opponent's next turn. All of your Digimon get with reboot gets plus a thousand and block. See, it's already a blocking reboot deck as it is, and for one memory, all of your mon just get buffed. That is dumb. I'm going to play it. Kiwi mon, uh, Minotamon. It looks like a little among us. Takumi Ayaba Tamer for our first rare. And one more Digimon Digiwalls, you may spend the Tamer to draw one. All level 3 Digimon gain a point of type and lose one. I'll have to look into how that works out, but okay. And first pack going to be higher than a rare? It is? It is a. <laughs> Rifflesamon, alright, um, yeah, this is definitely, like, double sleeve territory here, so let's go ahead and inner sleeve you, and then our dragon shields here, and clear, clear, and then clear, because I want to be able to see this back in the park too, alright, Digiverse 2. Right. And on your turn, once per turn, one of your Digimon activates Digiverse, one of your opponent's Digimon can't attack or block. Okay, so that just tries countering a blocking deck. That's what it does. I'll take it. So it's nice that they built in the ability to try and counteract or just fight against other decks, right? You don't really truly counter things in Digimon. You just have the ability to fight against specific things. Because every deck has its gimmick, right? No, oh, come on. Quit being difficult to stack up. Black Gaomon. 
Uh, Galgamon, sorry. What's your where we can actually read in case someone wants to pause the video and read what the card does and I'll read off. Cute, cute mon. I was about to say cute mon. <laughs> Commandramon. Uh, si Siakomon. Blech. Another Agumon. We have plenty of Agumons in these sets. Uh, Ultimate Flare. It is a machine deck option. D did involve three. Okay, that's good actually. Clademon. Maimon, I'm a little tired, I'm sorry. Spiral Masquerade, yellow option. Guilemon. Okay. Uh, Sak Sakuyamon, a level six rare, yellow, I will take it. Um, when opponent Digimon moves from the breeding to the battle area, it gains security attack minus three. And on your turn, all of your opponent's security Digimon get minus 3,000 DP. That is good. That's actually pretty good. I like that. And are we gonna have another super rare? Or secret rare? Oh, it's a secret rare! <laughs> I don't know what it is about me getting Omnimons. But holy crap, I've, I think so far I've gotten one from, I got the version 1.0, I got the 1.5, I don't remember if I got one in Great Legend, I don't even know if I finished opening one in Great Legend, I need to check that, because I just saw this, I was like, ooh, bye. Okay, your Digimon with Omnimon in its name can Digivolve into this card in your hand for a memory cost of 3, ignoring this card's Digivolution requirements. Okay. When attacking, delete one of your opponent's Digimon with DP less than or equal to this Digimon's DP. Opponent's turn when your opponent's Digimon attacks. You may trash two of this Digimon's Digivolutions to end the attack. So you just straight up stop an attack. And you can make this basically a level 8. Because you can just throw it on top of your regular Omni Hunt, right? Oh, that is awesome. Secret rares are so cool. I love them. I love my Omni <laughs> uh, I have a buddy of mine. I really hope he watches the video. But salty comment. I'll probably link him the video because I keep getting these Omni Mons and this is an I love it. Uh, I'm pretty sure I got like a stack of cards that he needed for decks that he wanted to build and he paid like market price for the individual cards. And I was just like, oh, look what I pulled. Like exactly the cards that you wanted for your decks. Good times. Good <laughs> All right, Mori Shellmon, uh, Troopmon, Karamon. I should probably go a little slower so you can read it if you want to. Uh, Monochromon, okay, another blocker. Uh, Kotemon, on play reveal. Black Mock Gaomon, he's got Reboot and here it's Reboot plus 2000. Well, when you have Reboot plus 2000. Loyal Nuts! Zeeg Greymon. So he has Blitz. Oh, that's pretty cool. That's a cool ability. And then he adds Blitz to as a variable. So if I have like Blitz jamming and a whole bunch of security attacks, which is an easy build for Ray. Superstarmon, Superstar. All right, Argamon, a level six green. Are we gonna be three for three right now on greater than rare? Way to find out. Uh, it's not. It's a rare. Earth Shaker Violet option. Delete and unsuspended level five and level. That's a bit situational, but 
I can see it working out in your favor, just stopping for a cost of six, especially since a lot of decks have that tamer and start you off at four memory. If you don't have any other options or if you have some like cheap digivolutions, you can minimize, or no, three memory, not four, I take that back, sorry. Uh, you can actually minimize the options your opponent's gonna have that next turn, right? Because let's say they're already gonna go to three memory anyways, you work yourself down to three, play that, they're at three. It's like, actually, yeah, three. Alright, last pack for today's video. Uh, which are, if you are enjoying, you know, hit that like button, subscribe, so you can get more content every week if you Pokemon playthroughs, and in the description of Twitch link. That's usually where I'm doing streams of building gun demos now. Uh, this week I'll be finishing up my Freedom Gundam, and I'll try... No, I won't be able to do any on the weekend, unfortunately. But the following week, so not the weekend of, like, the 20th, but the following week, going into uh, October, Daramon, uh, Peladramon, Maramon. Sorry, I'll show you a few cards, thank you, Tony. I'm planning on trying to do a weekend stream as well, so keep an eye out for those if you're following me on Twitch. Uh, Cubimon, Marine Devimon, okay, more Devimon cards. Jokermon, I like the size. Uh, Palmon, Absolute Blast. Oh, that's good. Uh, Gigimon. Chris Paladramon, or Paladramon, what do you do? When Digivolving trash the bottom Digivolution card of all opponents, of all of your opponents, Digimon. Oh. And then he inherits a security attack plus one. Oh. Tai Kamiya and Matt Ishida. Oh, right, we have, we have white trainers now. I didn't even realize that with uh, Takumi Aiba, I thought he was a yellow tamer. No, white. Okay. If your opponent has a level six or higher Digimon, gain two memory. All of your Digimon with Omnimon in their names gets pretty attack plus one. I always run Omnimon decks because he's the best card that I have. Even with like my Imperial Dramon, I still run an Omnimon because I don't have two of either of them. But now I'm probably <laughs> <laughs> oh, remember when I was talking about blitz and plus security attacks? Huh? Huh? Okay. And last is going to be Arata Sonata, a machine deck tamer. Start of turn, Digimon with unidentified in its type in my trash. If a Digimon with unidentified in its name is in your trash, gain one memory. Okay, so that's probably like Matt's if your opponent has no Digivolutions to gain one, that you can only do the one per card as opposed to, you know, you have I have 10 of them in there, I get 10 memory. No, I would need four tamers to get four memory. And then on my turn, when one of my Digimon Digivolves into Diaboromon, I may spend him to play another a Diaboromon token without its memory cost. It's a level 6 white with a memory cost of... Generally a memory cost of 15. They're an identified type, but no attribute. So it just... Still, like the previous... I think it was another tank that I got. That had that effect as well. Of playing the tokens. Or was it... What was it? The Boromon that I got. And you just play the token, right? On its digivolution, and the whole point is your setup for another one. So, I mean, I mean, it's not gonna have any heritable effects, but hey. So, let's look at whether we open up this normal pack or not, right? Remember, I gotta call it. Okay. Crank up the volume. 
you have any home assistance, you might want to mute them real quick because I'm going to call all heads on this one. Okay, Google, flip a coin. It landed on heads. Oh, we actually got one, me too. We actually got one. All right, let's open up this promo pack, finally. And whoever's been here since I got the promo pack, you're probably like, yes, finally, he's doing it. And I'm just like, oh man, I wanted to keep the promo pack going for a while. But remember, that's not gonna increase our chance of opening that Battle of Omni pre-release because I sent you a roll in awe for it. With my luck, I'm gonna end up with another promo pack. That's what happened with all of these. Like, I ended up with three, and I decided I'm just gonna open that one pre-release pack. All right, so we're gonna do these from the bottom upside down, all right? Because I have no idea what these are. I'm gonna lay them all out, okay? So first we have an Agumon promo. On play, delete one of your opponent's Digimon with 3,000 or less. Ooh, that's fun. And all, I'm pretty sure most, if not all of these are foil as well. A Biomon uh, has, gives you an inherited effect uh, when this Digimon deletes one of your opponent's Digimon in battle and survives, trigger draw one. So that's good to evolve from. It's a zero cost Digivolution as well. Alright. Gabumon. Trash bottom of, uh, on play, trash bottom Digivolution card of one of your opponent's Digimon. Okay. Keeping with the blue of trashing away uh, Digivolutions. Goemon. Uh, on your turn, once per turn, when you trash a Digivolution card of one of your opponents, gain one memory. That's actually a good Gamomon. Most of them are no effect, so vanilla or just bad. Alright. Okay, two more left. What do we have here? Padamon. On play, if you have one or fewer security cards, trigger recovery plus one. I think that's like the standard one from the deck. Last card. Now is it gonna be like a Palomon? Is it going to be a ye another yellow? I mean, it's a promo for the pre, it's like the pre-pre release, right? It is before for a one point out. No, I think it's gonna be another yellow. I really hope it's something really good though. Cause you know, last card's are a good card, right? It is a Gatomon. I did not realize that you were a promo. Although it makes sense, you were in that initial run, so I was right. <laughs> two yellows, two reds, and two blues trying to beef up those, those starter decks, right? And when you have three or more security cards, Digimon, that it grow, Digivolves to, it gets plus a thousand DP. Which, yellow deck originally tends to have some recovery, right? So going over the hits again, we have Tai Kamiya and Matt Ishida, White Tamer, uh, Aratusanada, uh, Machine Deck Tamer, Argomon, Green Level 6, Earthshaker, Violet Option, Sakuyamon, Yellow, Level 6, Takumi Ayaba, another White Tamer, uh, the Omnimon X Antibody Secret Rare, and... <laughs> Rafflesamon level 6 green uh, Digimon. I'm going to just put Omnimon there because, you know, he is the poster child of Digimon. Uh, <laughs> and yeah, we're going to leave it there. Another sort of long one, but that was mainly because I think the coin flip and we had a bunch of good hits. I hope we keep getting a bunch of secrets just to provide amazing hits and good content for you uh if not it's fine i'm doing this for the collection and then being able to play like i'm not planning on playing green i'm probably mainly going to play red blue and machine i still need to actually try out my machine deck with, against my buddy i haven't had a chance to like look through what the deck actually started that came with and how i could augment it with the cards that i have drawn from the booster boxes i've opened 
Uh, I sort of want to finish opening this booster box before I play it and see how I can refit my blue and red decks, but that is for future SE to figure out and current SE to not worry about. So I hope you enjoyed. If you did, once again, hit that like button. I'll really appreciate it, and I will see you all next time. Peace, peace.